Right, you'll all be glad to know we're back on AMS2 and we're not in VTOL VR at all. Although midway for the race, things may change. Only joking. So here we are at Le Mans and we're running uh, mods and standard Class C cars. There's a clunk my headset off my gear stick. Four laps. Are you ready? And we are in the Jaguar the Jag. Starting from the back of the pack, 32 cars on track, including me. So I know the like on this first corner, I'm just going to wear it. You see, see, look. All the jelly moulds are doing my trick, whipping around the edge. The AI are as sneaky as I am. When you're driving, do you grip your wheel like you're hanging onto a cliff? Like your life depended on it. Well, stop it. The light hold on the wheel. On your right. The light grip on the wheel. On your right. You will get a lot more force feedback coming through to you about what the car's doing. And. Have more control to not fighting against your own muscles with white knuckle syndrome it will make you faster it will give you better force feedback feeling from the car all you got to do release that death grip oh, get tangled up with these i used to when i race Rally games, the grey and so on and so forth. I always have a light grip on the uh, steering. Always. Just the way I do it. But when I'm track racing, I'm always on a... There's a gap. I'm always on a death grip. And since getting that handy hint, which is in a YouTube video, um, yeah, I'm still fighting the... Uh, the muscle memory to suddenly just like grip on to like sheer death. Alright. For those moments when you're uh, brain's in control. Still there. Clear right. On your right. It does make things a whole lot Still different, there. so Clear that's right place. people. It's a fight at first if you are a deaf gripper. So I'm assigning you all because I was a deaf gripper. Right side. Anyway. On we go. In the Jaguar XJR V12. Against the Nissan Jelly Mold. Jim has been decidedly quiet. Which I'm glad about. Maybe he didn't survive that crash in VTOL yesterday. Trying to find a way through. It just keeps changing his uh, position, bouncing around on the track. Now they're pretty bad on the brakes, these guys. Yeah. Car right. Clear right. We'll just uh, dive in there on the first UK. We are still using the. Uh, Stupidly high settings on the graphics. Frame counts is top right. I've no idea what it is. It seems to be uh, good. I want not to watch the video back, so I might just be talking out my hat and I'll have to lower them again. Run right through there. Right, this lap I'm just going to be quiet, concentrate, and let you enjoy the sights and sounds of Le Mans. Speak to you on the next lap. Okay, so we'll just decrease it. It's now 20 Celsius. I also got quick when I don't speak. On your 
right. I'm back. Okay, we've got back up on the next gaggle. C-Class doing what C-Class does best. Just, uh, shut up, Jim. I'm not listening to you. Not after the antics of yesterday, going rogue. So yeah, C classes, you've got the power, you've got the speed, but you've still got control, it's old school. Unlike the Jaguar, it just hasn't got the power. I have dropped the uh, rear downforce by two notches. Still not got the power. Pretty good on the brakes though. Nice and controlled in the uh, twisty stuff. Fortunately we're at Le Mans so that doesn't really count for a lot. I'm gonna say it. Oh it's foggy. You know what to write in the comments below now. Look at that fog. I'm looking for a gap. There's half a gap. I'm having it. I'll leave him enough room. He wanted more than... He wanted more. Massive clutch slit. Okay. Take care of that because normally I'll burn the clutch out in these cars. Right. 
the AI was not giving a quarter. Dust there from the dirty bout of the track you saw up ahead. Very rare the AI will go on it, but when you do, you do notice it. Second this time. See what I mean? There you go. And again, starting to see a lot of it now as the race goes on. A lot of dust being kicked up as the uh, just go off the line. Could have done nowhere to go. Oh, late turning there is a bit blindsided. One feature that I've not been able to show clearly, which is the uh, dust. Jim, 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 lad, Jim, 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 Jim. You can't shoot him up once he starts, you can't shoot him up. So, like I was saying, that's one feature. Jim! Oh. Have you finished now, Jim? Being informative and helpful. Have you finished? I'm going to wait to get on the most on straight. There's nothing for him to talk about there. Okay. I tentatively say that was one feature I was trying to show but hadn't been able to clearly, which is the, uh, the update with the dirt on the dirty, less used bits of track being kicked up. I'm going to get close down here, Anna. Bit of a lock up, tyres getting off a bit. There we go, front cones at me again. So, yeah, which is part of the update. So, I'm glad I got that in a couple of occasions. We'll have a look on this uh, next lap, which is the last lap, which I shouldn't have looked because you know what that means. But we will uh, attempt to see it in all its glory. Come on, didn't touch you. Leapt out of the way like a scalded cat then. Right side. Watch your line. Clear right. Okay, here we go. So down here. Prevalent for it. Oh, slipping that clutch again in third. Just before it's seven grand. Be a bit slower than the clutch uh, showing. Everybody's going to be perfectly on the racing line now. You watch. Nissan Jelly Mold just blown it all away with his twin exhaust flamethrowers. I think so. It's the guys that are over here that were doing it. They're all online, so we're not going to see any of it. But a cool feature nonetheless. You do spot when it happens, you do see it. You do go, oh no, oh no, oh no. Can we get the Nissan on our little dive up the inside yes we can 
went to death grip there, loosen my grip on the steering wheel. That's better. And we're greeted by yet another Nissan Jelly Mold. That's the last lap, it's good. Easy tiger, watch the sausage. Carty sausage there. Clutches in one piece, we didn't crash. We got to the end. That's disappointing. Jim, that's disappointing, is it? Right, okay. See you back in the pits. What for told you about those negative waves, man?